different. Uh, we're in my car, obviously. And we're driving to work. I just wanted to make this first video the uh, POV point of view video of what's it like to drive my VTEC. A 2006 Honda Civic SI. The only thing I've done to it was throw a Canaan filter. Uh, it's not even short ram, it's not even cold air. Uh, all I did was cut the mass airflow sensor, the MAF housing, just a little brick like this where it goes in. And I chopped that shit off. Put a uh, coupler to connect it to the throttle body and the k and filter. The exhaust, I know the exhaust has been modified. I really don't know what's done to it. The only thing that I know, it has the stock headers. Uh, and from the catalytic converter back, it has three inch piping the way to your resonator your muffler uh, from there it dips down back to two and a half piping but I think that extra piping that extra big ass lung it has it's giving it a little bit of more extra torque I'm not sure but I've smoked a lot of SI's so I do not know if mine's tuned or not also, my brother has a 2007 Honda Civic Si, oh, I'm sorry, 2008, 2008 Honda Civic Si, Coupe, FG2, just like mine, uh, and he said his rip limiter cuts out at 8 thousandths, mine goes to 8 and a half. rims I do not know what size they are but I am rocking 225s 225s I think 45s uh, not too sure let me just open the door and check real quick <laughs> but they're a lot wider than the stock tires they're sticking out uh, it looks like it might have been lowered, not really too sure. Doesn't look like I have much of a wheel gap, maybe an inch wheel gap, but it could be the tires that is taking up the extra uh, space in there. Um, but I want to go coilover, but I don't want to go cheap eBay coilovers. I don't want that shit to give me problems later.
everybody's slowing the fuck down. I'm not to jump in between these trucks. Oh! There's our friend right there, Mr. Highway Patrol. It's the motherfucker we're trying to avoid. Nice fresh day. Free horsepower.
always got to keep a lookout for no motherfucking cops. I don't know if you'll see me doing that in the camera a lot, but I'm like looking around most of the time. Hey, baby. Hi, Caleb. Huh? Oh, mom said send her money for gas? Okay, I'll send her some money for gas, all right. <laughs> nice. My wife had my... Hello? Hello? What's up, Caleb? Okay. I love you, Caleb. Bye. Have a good day at class. I love you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I picked up the call on the Android radio. This shit's tight, man. This is badass. I just wish it was a little bit more. Creative. Wish you could mess around with the settings more. Uh, it's limited. But fuck, dude, I got access to the Google Play Store. What's up? <laughs> you know? mods I want to do to this car. Man, let me get my phone real quick. Shit. I already got some shit I want to buy. I don't know. You guys tell me about this, man. This is some eBay shit. I got a family of five, six with this one right here. Man, I can't support this bitch, but I want to. So I got a throttle body spacer OBX. Oh. Uh, 70 bucks. Stainless steel tri-y exhaust header. All the way back. Cuts the cat out. Uh, I need to replace my fucking air compressor. Man. In Fresno, California. The heat is no joke. I think it was 115 last year. Fuck that shit. It's fucking 60 degrees and I'm sweating balls already. <laughs> I got my front, rear drilled and slotted. Uh, 121 bucks. These are badass. I'll show you some pictures real quick. Uh, there's nothing to do. There's not the business. Yeah, it has double drill and slotted. What's up?
dash cam. I have this one hooked up to Torque, the Torque app. If you guys don't know what the Torque app is, you guys need to check it out. Shit is tight. It's an OBD2 Bluetooth reader. Um, and you hook it up to your phone. Simple as that. You have fancy tacks. Speedometer. The gear you're shipped into. Mass airflow sensor, intake temperature, engine load, all kinds of shit. It's pretty tight. pulled you over you're too fucking loud motherfucker get monetized from my retech sound. Every fucking K20 sounds the fucking same. Coming over here to take a little break before we have to go to work. I'll give a little walk around of the car. Oh, 
I am the creator that pushed to start. Check it out. Do, 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 do. I just couldn't get bypass the security feature, but I found something online that I could purchase to get bypass it. Eventually, this car is a fucking project. This car was garbage when I first picked it up. Look at it now. Man, this car has came a long, long way. Let me take this shit off my head. Yeah. This car has came a long way. Put those stickers in the ribs. Put those stickers there. Put those uh, caps in the center. Put those stickers there. Put those markers there. Uh, painted the rig, the wheels, but now because I'm scraping all over the place because I need new shock observers, you can tell I'm scraping 225s, 45s. I had to buy this badge, I got a reverse cam, uh, it's a plain old exhaust, but it sounds loud. lights leave left the white white <laughs> put these I installed these I installed this repainted this uh, installed this one because it didn't have it installed the boot got that uh, vi uh, vinyl wrap it vinyl wrap vinyl wrap I threw that right there Put that right there, restitch the steering wheel, that, Android, that, this, that, fucking the mat, the sub. Now let me show you my sub. Let me show you my sub real quick. I got a repair phone kit because uh, I have a YouTube channel. Obviously, <laughs> a subscriber told me about that they needed to put this my shit. Ah uh, man, this this is the the system is still work in progress, dude. Because when I had it stock, it fucking sounded fantastic. Like man, I've never had a fucking hard ass knocking beat like that. I have work on my Camaro, but it sounded fantastic. Now it does not sound so fantastic. So I took out the factory amp out. The you hear the static on the fucking tweeters. I installed these tweeters around wire, electricity here, electricity here, <sighs> another one here, anyways, I don't know, it just fucked everything up, look, I have switches here for my amp, switches here for the lights down here, um, this one is so I can turn on my radio without having the key in, um, I've done so much to this fucking car, so much, tinted the windows, put the visors, Put the visor up here. Man, uh, I put a uh, eyebrow on my fucking headlights, and I, I painted it myself with the with the window tint or the, uh, the back out lens tint. Uh, I put the SI symbol in the front. I put the fucking skirts, easy lips, all the way around. I think it makes it look fucking badass. I've never seen my another Civic with the lips. It looks fucking sweet painted the bottom red man i've done so much shit to this car so much shit i did the big three upgrade uh this is what i'm talking about right here this is my setup uh just fucking open throttle big three everywhere fucking zero gauge wires running from the end, from the uh alternator to the battery to the ground to the chassis chassis right there same all this red there's red LEDs inside man I've done so much to this car man I'm trying to think if I've done anything else oh yeah I fucking I cleared I blacked out my 
airbag light because with the cold days they like to turn on for some reason. <sighs> LEDs inside. My drive to work, my Civic SI 2006. I can love this car. This car is the shit. Just how you see me beating it up on there, I fucking beat on it all day. That's why I feel bad for my boy Gerv. I'm for Gerv Productions. If you guys haven't seen his videos, check it out on YouTube, man. I'll throw his link down below. This nigga, goddamn, I feel so bad for him. He swapped out so many parts in this Civic. I just barely got mine. I've had it for close to a year. I've been banging it every fucking day, and I haven't had to change out one thing. Thank you. Thank you, Honda. Thank you. Yeah, so with that, we'll cut it out. Peace.